Good day everyone! We're now going to discuss about Thorndike's Laws of Learning. Who is Edward Thorndike? He is an American psychologist whose work on animal behavior and the learning process led to the theory of connectionism, which states that behavioral responses to specific stimuli are established through a process of trial and error that affects neural connections between the stimuli and the most satisfying responses. There are three principal laws of learning. Law of readiness, law of exercise, and law of effect. Law of readiness. It states that when an organism is ready to act, action is satisfying, inaction is annoying. The reverse is true. So, if an organism is not ready to act, action is annoying and inaction is satisfying. Example A pupil who knows the answer feels satisfied if he is cold. On the other hand, he feels annoyed if asked to recite when he doesn't know the answer. When a child is not ready to learn, he cannot be forced to learn. Likewise, the teacher should adopt the principles of individual differences. The easier learning tasks should be assigned to pupils of less mental ability and the more difficult tasks should be assigned to the pupils with superior mental ability. Law of Exercise It states that exercise or practice reinforces learning. This places significance on drill, repetition, and review. Retention invariably results. Frequent recitation of a poem, if fully comprehended, results to mastery. Law of Effect It states that learning is strengthened if it gives satisfaction to the learner. It is weakened if it gives annoyance to the learner. The implication is that teachers should make learning sessions as enjoyable as possible. One way of doing this is by praising appropriately to those who are performing well. So here are our references from Jose F. Calderon Foundations of Education and Britannica.com Here are also photo references. Thank you very much for watching and keep safe. Please subscribe for more content.